go. Oh, hey everybody, guess where Lori and I are? I'm just gonna pan Lori, so hang on a sec. Lori, say hi. Hey everyone, happy Saturday. We're here up at Blue, and I'm just gonna show you guys something. What you think you can do, and what you think you can do. We hiked up this mountain, can you see it? OMG, oh, let me turn it around, hang on a sec. Hang on, I'm ending my live. <laughs> anyway, I don't know if you guys can see that. So uh, there's a gondola. Some people are taking the gondola up. We actually walked up. So, so we have to there you go. So I'm gonna area. go show. Okay, I got this all mixed up. So there you go. We came, we came up that mountain, and the bay is in the background. And now Lori is rehabbing from a hip injury, where she fell off her bike. She's like an amazing athlete. Just flex your muscles, our little girlfriend. So oh my God. Her muscles. Now. Her muscles have muscles. So. Here we are on a beautiful Saturday, getting out there, enjoying the fresh air. It's a perfect, perfect day. And so what does all this have to do with you guys and us? Why are we doing this? It's always pushing the envelope and doing the thing you think you can't do because when you do it, you know, you're like, oh, that's pretty cool. I didn't think I could and now I can. So we walked up this mountain and a lot of people are taking the gondola up. Oh, you see that? There's people taking the gondola up. Let me go this way. There you go. They're taking the gondola. But we walked up, up it and we had to take stops. We had to like walk straight up. Yep. Find I think the level. that's the message is uh, there was a time when I could have like jogged this hill and when you're rehabbing nerves they get tired and the smart thing to do is not be stupid and try and grind and push but to just do a little bit celebrate the win we'd stop we'd have a sip of water we would rest and then we do the next section and there's probably eight sections to do who cares how fast there's and that's the biggest thing is we're so conditioned culturally to have to grind it out to have to do it perfectly to have to be at some elevated level especially when you're already an athlete challenging yourself to be uncomfortable and do a little bit and celebrate wherever you're at and then can I do just a little bit more can I take another five steps can I go another 20 feet and if you stay so focused in the moment and you pay attention to what you're doing and you listen to your body and then you just take a breath and you do it again you know it's it's a story how do you climb a mountain we just climbed a mountain we did it one, <laughs> one step, step at, at a time. time and hey Amy nice to see you Amy's my friend from Florida my mom's awesome. on here and my mom posts an emoji she's laughing her head off because I'm always telling her to just go my mom's 87 you guys right and she uses all of these products she's healthy and I just say to her just get out and enjoy the sunshine just go walk 10 minutes right so mom I hope you're getting out there and enjoying the sunshine and just you know, do what you can and rest if you get tired. Just stop, enjoy where you are. Because we're also focused in the doing. Like, look at this view, you guys. We, we, you know, That's we, the being. Yeah. The being part is the conversation we've had every time we paused. Because when we were walking, because Carolyn's also coming off an injury, we're very focused on every step we're taking. So you pause and you look around and you breathe and you appreciate. I mean, this is take your breath away nature. Yeah. Way better than a treadmill in a gym. Yeah, and so, hey Karen, nice to see you. Karen's in uh, a, a, one of our ISA gals. Uh, and it's hot and humid in Florida, so in that we were having your kind of uh, weather here, right? And Jeff, hey Jeff, how are you? <laughs> my, one of my favorite guys. Happy belated birthday. I know you had a great birthday and your wife did some very special things for you. But you can talk about some of them. So um, anyhow, guys, we just wanted to share what we're doing here. Lots of people, lots of families out here enjoying this beautiful, beautiful area. And so it's nice to see all of you guys who tuned in. And hashtag replay and tell us what you got out of this. If you were inspired by you know, what you see here to go out and do something, even take one step towards the thing that you think you couldn't do. So from Lori Clark and myself, we said, happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. Bye everyone.